it's uh, Mother's Day and I have to go to work today, which really, really sucks. Um, hopefully it's only for a couple hours, but I really honestly don't know how long it's gonna take. Um, either way, I'm missing out on brunch with my wife and spending time with her, just our family, which is super annoying because my wife is a superstar mom and she deserves some some time to be doted on, but that's not gonna happen today because then after work, we're going over to my mom's house, obviously, to celebrate with my mom for a little bit. So basically there won't be much time to celebrate Kelsey, but I guess it is what it is. All right, I'll see you after work. About to leave, already packing. Come with me, I'm not really asking. We'll get away to a place where we don't. All right, I'm busting out. No, I uh, work is to the, to a point where I can leave, so I'm leaving. Uh, I'm gonna go see where Kelsey and the boys are and go from there. Okay, I guess the timing worked out pretty well. Uh, Kelsey and the boys are at my sister-in-law's house um, and the boys are napping. So I figured while they're napping, I'd come home, I'm gonna get a quick workout in, and then I'll get ready, put the dogs up, go pick up Kelsey and the boys, and then uh, we'll go over to my mom's. So I'm gonna work out now. About to see the world in action. What we can be, life with no distractions. All right, today's workout was uh, it was so so. Uh, I think it's a combination of things. Uh, woke up and kind of woke up, had to go right to work. So low on caffeine. Haven't drank much coffee. Um, I'm not doing my pre-workout anymore, which I think I'm gonna, I'm just gonna have to get used to used to that. Kind of throws you off your routine. Uh, haven't eaten anything today yet. It's super freaking hot now. I guess it's not really that hot, but it's hotter than what ha what it has been. So I'm gonna have to get to use again to working out in a hot garage. Anyways, the workout was so-so. It was, it was good in some senses, not so good in others. It's done now. I'm gonna get ready, go pick up the family, and then we're gonna go over to my mom's. I, I'm showered now, not so hot and sweaty. Uh, I'm on my way to pick up Kelsey and the boys, or at least see, uh, see them. Uh, the cow may still be napping, so maybe a little bit. But uh, I'm on my way. Today, I'm sure, hasn't been the Mother's Day that Kelsey would have liked it to be, but ah, uh, such is life. My, uh, my ninth grade, no, 10th grade, the uh, world history teacher, Miss Robinson Gray, we all called her Miss RG. She was this uh, older black lady, and she'd been teaching for a long time, you know? Seen a lot, been through a lot. But she used to say that all the time. Ah, such is life. Which is another way to say, it is what it is. This is what we waited for. Give him a hug. Bye. Give him a hug. Give him a hug. There you he go. Say bye bye to Cal. Say see you tomorrow. Sam. Okay, that's fine. He's like, I just went out of here. Dude. Okay, fine. All right, guys. See, see you guys. Mother's Day. Again. Be careful. Watch your step. Hey, bud. Thanks for waiting on me. Thanks for waiting on me. No, we gotta get mom's car. Where are we? Papa. Papa's house? Are you gonna give Tia a hug? You gonna give your Tia a hug? Give Tia a hug. Give me a hug. Take my hand, we'll make it somehow. We can't miss out. I'm done living life with the lights out. Die with my own doubts. Be free with me. Let's go.
as a cliche We're on the run This is what we waited for Love you. Yeah, yeah.